Oh, cheers for your time there, Charlie. Old uh, Paul Sapsford would have been proud of that match there. Hard fought from both sides. You happy with the team? Oh, we're happy to get the win, mate. I'm um, happy to get the victory, um, especially over a quality side like Varsity. So, yeah, we're definitely happy, especially with the um, with the, yeah, the Sapper Memorial on the line as well. So, lock that away for uh, in the trophy cabinet for 2014, and um, yeah, I'm sure the supporters will be happy. Very good. Now, um, a little uh, interesting, interesting decision you had uh, Casey kicking over Hayden the Gun Parker there. Was that a decision because you might not have the services of Hayden all year? Oh, Josh has done a, a great job of um, in the games this season of kicking goals for us. Um, so it only made sense for, for him to be handed the duties. Now, um, you, you struggled to put them away there for a while, even with the yellow cards. That was something you'd be a little disappointed in. Yeah, I think we struggled to play some constructive footy. Um, and we probably only, you know, 10, 15 minutes during that game, we actually strung phases together and off um, offset piece. And, um, and we looked really good, but, you know, that's only 15 out of 80 minutes. So. Yeah, plenty to work on, um, early days, but yes, yeah, like I say, pretty disappointing that we couldn't um, construct a few more opportunities. Now, um, your major work-ons, what would that be for the next game? Um, uh, defence, um, getting off the line, and obviously discipline, that really killed us, I think. They scored a truckload of points um, off our ill-discipline and off our mistakes, so yeah, mate, so defence, and uh, and also just when we're on attack, just um, ruck time, cleaning out, getting rid of the threats, I'd say. Now, um, you look to play the game at pace. Will you continue that all season, or is it just team by team basis? Um, you know, I mean, that's how that's the way we play. We like to play high tempo. We like to to, to spin the ball out wide. Um, yeah, if the conditions are right, we'll, we'll keep doing that. Sweet. Cheers, Charlie. Thanks for your time, Thanks man. Thanks very much. Now, um, curious start there. Uh, you guys came in quite late, a few minutes after the kick -off, uh, kick off was supposed to happen. What happened there? Oh, I don't think there's uh, any hidden agendas there. Um, there was just we didn't hear a whistle, and, and that's what we no mind up. games there. No mind games. No mind games. Tyre weren't happy, but it was a miscommunication, I think. Uh, you know, a tough old couple of weeks there. Doesn't get any easier. Dean last week, Eels this week. Yeah, yep. coming against Tyre, we're pretty confident, like in. And um, I don't think you get any any closer than that and uh, we had the team out there to do it today and we got bloody close but at the end of the day we made too many errors and gave away too many penalties. Now um, you fought back well after a pretty shaky start, you'd be pretty happy with that. Oh yeah, the boys are, we're a good, good tight group here and uh, the boys dug deep but once again uh, it was the last five minutes that killed us, we had the opportunities and didn't take them. Now line outs were an issue obviously, something you'll definitely need to work on for the next yeah, game. Yeah, I thought we um, they went pretty well in the first half, we won all our ball. Um, Probably possibly when we were under pressure, uh, they seemed to change up their um, defensive and, and just went the wrong place, I suppose. Yeah. Doesn't help when you got line out masters like Brad Thorne and <laughs> the opposition line out there. There's a chat from him and he was moving around, but at the end of the day, uh, we should back the systems and yeah. Now, and also discipline was a major issue. Um, we need to yeah, also I was um, up. pretty disappointed with that, to be fair. Um, definitely work on. Uh, we have a good chat about it on Tuesday at training, I suppose. Um, we, that's just it's not good enough to be fair. Mm. And uh, who would be a standout for you for this game? Uh, good call. I think um, everyone played well in patches, but um, at the end of the day, I don't think with uh, having a loss, I'm not going to pick on anyone in particular. Yeah. <laughs> You're going to give me one name. Come on, Stuggy. Uh, John Hyde. <laughs> good on you, buddy. <laughs> Cheers for your time.